Hello, we are live on YouTube. Been a long time, long time. Uh, my best guess is <clears throat> they took away the requirement to have like a thousand followers or something stupid like that. Um, so, a little bit. I'm trying not to <clears throat> not to show my shirt. It has a, a particular not so good um, wording or whatever on there. Um, but anyway, my day has gone pretty good. Yep, yep. I woke up around uh, ten. I want to say. Uh, the dishes done. I went and made some coffee, which I found an absolutely very yummy um, way to go about making coffee. Um, basically, I have a French press. And if you guys don't know what a French press is, it's basically like a, a glass or metal-based tube cup thing that the, you go and you put the coffee into, and then you put some hot water, and then there's a little, uh, little knob you, you um, press down, and it kind of uh, allows the beans to open up and release the very yummy um, um, bean juice, I guess. So anyway, like I was saying, um, I found out if you put salt, not a lot, but just a little bit of salt into the coffee grounds. It allows it to be a lot less bitter, um, which is nice, you know. Um, but uh, you put some salt into the uh, coffee grounds, and then you pour, usually I like to boil water into a teapot, uh, and then once, you know, the teapot thing whistles you uh you go off and let it sit for about 30 40 seconds and then you pour it in there and you slowly just ever so gently like press the little like you know french press thing down and you do that two three times um and it has such a different taste to it compared to what you would get with a, um, a normal coffee pot or like a Keurig or it's, it's hard to explain. It's just, it's just a different, better taste. Ever since I've started doing that, actually, I, uh, I can no longer, um, drink like Dunkin' Donuts or Starbucks. It just doesn't taste too good. Um, so I would advise going and checking out a French press um, I found a mine on Amazon for like, with tax, it was like $32 or something. It wasn't that bad. And it's, it, it, it's a very sturdy glass uh, French press with like some stainless steel on it and whatnot. Hi, honey. Um, but yeah, anyway, I went and made some coffee. I did the dishes, um, took the dog out. Yep, yep. Uh, cleaned up the counters and the stove. Uh, took the trash out. And then the wife came home from work. And now uh, either her or I will end up making dinner, whichever one feels up to it. I might kind of shove her out of the way, make dinner for her. I just don't entirely know what I'm going to make yet. I made some some dinner for us yesterday. Um, I basically went and attempted to make like a, a Mexican rice with a, uh, with some beans and some sausage in there, but I didn't have like actual Mexican rice. I just had like normal rice. So I was thinking, I was like, okay, well, can't be too awful difficult to make that on your own. Um, so I just, I went and took some 
normal rice. You know, I, I washed it and whatnot. Um, and I threw some cumin. I threw some paprika, uh, some garlic salt, some onion, like some, you know, dried onion stuff. Um, I threw some pepper and some salt. And I just kind of mixed it up with my hands ever so lightly. Um, but yeah, and I did that, and then I uh, took some black beans, and I kind of washed the uh, black beans, um, cut up some peppers, and some onions, and some cheese-stuffed sausages, and I kind of, you know, cooked them and whatnot. Um, and it turned out... It wasn't bad. It, 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 it was spicy. Um, and not the kind of spicy that you would kind of associate with hot sauce. This was like I used too much spices kind of spicy. Um, but all in all, it wasn't, wasn't that bad. But I'm thinking about maybe, uh, maybe using the stuff I made last night. And uh, we have some saltine crackers um, in the, or in our little pantry, and I was wondering, and I was thinking about maybe throwing some oil onto these saltine crackers, um, and throwing them into the oven to kind of make sort of kind of tortilla-ish chips, I guess, and I'm kind of making like a, a, a taco salad. I think I might, might do that, I'm not sure, but, all right, well, I will end the video here now that I'm aware that I am able to go live. I just can't go live on my phone. Don't know why, but so I might go and start doing a lot more lives uh, like this instead. So stay safe, guys. Oh, um, I also have a TikTok. Um, I have a, a lot of videos on there. Um, you know, the TikTok is, uh, let me pull it up here, Ch -ch -ch -ch. turn the volume down, I don't want to get, uh, like demonetized or whatever, my TikTok is, uh, Mint Witch, that's it, you know, Mint, M-I-N-T, and then Witch was, you know, W-I-T-C-H, so I post stuff on there, um, I have an Instagram as well, and that's, you know, the mint witch. Um, so, yeah. You can kind of check up there. I, I have a Twitter as well. Um, and that is, again, just mint witch. You can basically find me under that name. Um, but, yeah, so I post stuff on there. And so, yeah. Stay safe, guys. See you soon.